Hi, how's it going everyone? This is Max Fisher here from A Better Universe. Your mind, body, spirit connection, and it's Mindfulness Monday, guys. I want to go over uh, how to get into a meditation, how to become meditative, how to um, find a little bit of a deeper uh, a deeper being inside you. A lot of people have a problem with meditation. Uh, they try it, they give it a little shot, they stick with it for about five or ten minutes and they realize yeah this isn't for me maybe I can't do it and my mind won't stop going crazy so the idea behind meditation is and there's um there's science to back this up that it takes 15 minutes of complete focus before you can get in the zone and the idea behind meditation is oh uh, it's a focus you you concentrate you actually um take the effort and the will to concentrate and focus on a sensation, on your breathing, on you know all kinds of different things, your thoughts, your emotions, all these things are just you concentrating and looking and observing on them. And uh, if you can just take the time to do it for 15 minutes, once you get in that zone, you'll find that you will find that deep meditative practice where things seem a lot or maybe just a little bit different than what they normally would, what you would normally perceive as you. So I want to take today and tell you how to take those first 15 minutes, how to take these, um, how to create that focus in these first 15 minutes to make it so that way uh, when you continue on past that, whether you're doing a transcendental meditation, whether you're doing energy work, uh, Buddha Shuddhi, or uh, you know, cure yoga, whether you're trying to do um, uh, pranayama breathing, uh, or whether you're trying to even do your visualizations and your, your law of attraction through that, it's good to have a focus so your mind doesn't drift and uh, uh, wander. So the, the basis behind this is big diaphragmatic breaths. So when you sit in this position with your legs crossed, when you turn your palms upwards like this, it makes you draw in from your uh, dantian, your lower stomach region. And that's diaphragmatic breathing. And when you diaphragmatically breathe, there's a nerve right next to your heart called the vagus nerve. And it, uh, it does, it, it's responsible for your fight or flight response. So taking these big diaphragmatic breaths actually activates that vagus nerve and makes you uh, relax, makes you calm down, um, you know, brings you to a certain peaceful state. So that's how I want to start this meditation. I want to start with big diaphragmatic breaths, calming down, maybe do it for the first um, five minutes or so. Uh, just deep breaths, you know, feeling the sensation, feeling the breath, feeling the rise and fall of it. And then um, after we move to that, after we build a little bit of focus there, um, when your mind starts to wander, just bring it back to the breath. That's how we keep our focus, guys. So if it starts to, you start finding it going other places, just remember, bring it right back to the breath and keep your hands, you know, facing upwards, sit in your, um, I mean, this isn't necessarily uh, the pose that you have to sit in, but it's been shown to um, bring the, the most benefits. So... We're gonna start with prana, uh, a little bit of, of a pranayama kinda, and uh, take those deep breaths, calm ourselves down, slow our uh, thinking and our heart rate down, and then we are gonna feel um, immense gratitude for this moment. Um, and then we are going to go into a stage of forgiveness where we forgive ourselves and we forgive others. And the gratitude in the forgiveness meditation has the most research behind it, the most backing research to change your brave way and function into somebody who's been meditating like a monk for, let's say, 20 or 30 years. So get in those two states and then you can take it from there. I'm going to just sign off really quickly, really briefly, um, and uh, you guys can stay meditating if you want or you can just leave it at that and see what it does for your day, see how it changes your mindset. So let's get right into it. Close your eyes. Take nice deep breaths in. In through the nose. And out 
through the mouth. Start releasing tension in the body. Drawing deep breaths. And exhale. sensation of the rise and fall with your breath. peace, let any tension you might be holding go, and breathe. Big full breaths. start to think of something that makes you grateful. Once you have that feeling, expand on it. Think of all the things that you have to be grateful for. The wind, the rain, the grass. This world, an opportunity. abundant life. Be grateful for the beauty in the moment. And everything that you have around you. How perfect everything moves and flows and grows. How everything has a little touch of divinity to it. Even you, you're a creation of a higher intelligence. Be grateful for your consciousness and your ability to perceive this world.
grateful for everything that you have. Take the time to forgive yourself and forgive others, no matter what they've done or what you've done. It was done in an unconscious manner. You and the other person really can't be held accountable for their actions because they don't even realize what caused them. Take that time to understand that we all make mistakes, that we're all learning in a process of growing. Learn to forgive these people who have done you wrong. Feel the weight lifted off your shoulders. One by one, visualize these people and you apologizing to them and forgiving them. You apologizing to yourself, forgiving yourself for whatever you might have done, for whatever they might have done. Once you let it go, it no longer holds power over you. If you hold on to this grudge, you're letting the past affect who you can become. You must forgive these people and yourself to move forward into your ultimate nature. Feel it wash over you. Maybe go further into your meditation. Maybe open your eyes. And view the world a little differently. Now that your perception has shifted. This is Max Fisher from A Better Universe. Your mind, body, spirit connection. Happy meditating, guys. Namaste.